You know what, Tony? I look at it today, and I and I and I've got to let you know I, I have never had a smoke in my life, never had a coffee in my life, never had a drug in my life. And, and you are a friend of mine. You know, uh, people think, oh yeah, he says that. You know that without a doubt. And people who know me know that it's factual that I've never. But um, I look at it today, and I think that I'm not stupid. And I I I look at athletes in certain sports and certain uh, organisations, and and you know that they are using. Um, performance performance drugs. enhancing drugs and well, I think by their physical well stature. by the, by by that and by the way they perform and I think that if that's the case well, and you hear a lot of innuendo and you hear rumor but I just think that if that's the case and um, if one's going to use it they should all be allowed but um, then again I'm I'm not a doctor and I don't know what those things are do for you in the in the in the long run or is it detrimental to you later on in life because I've like I said I've never I've never done that I've hardly taken a vitamin in my life but um, I always believe in eating properly and, and hard work, and that's how I got my my results. But um, when you look at and, and and you hear some of the stories about some of the cyclists toured of France and this and that, and I'm not going to mention any names, but when you're here, um, you hear, some of these guys have got a, an unfair advantage, and then the, you know um, the guys who aren't are always going to come second, third and fourth and fifth and sixth and, and so on, and, you know. What, do you know much about Nodos, the caffeine uppers? Um, dodos? <laughs> I wouldn't have a clue what you're talking about, mate. They're, and that's, that's the honest truth. So none of your people you've trained or boxers that you know of used them for, to train or to fight? Never, mate. Well, I don't know. Well, I couldn't tell you because um, they certainly weren't told the have a whatever they are from me because I wouldn't know what they'd do for you. So you promote natural ability and... I promote hard work and, and loving what you do and doing it for love. And um, whatever you get um, as a result of, of hard work and stuff, I, I believe, uh, gives you your greatest high anyway. Um, for me, if I thought that I had had help achieving what I achieved or if I in any way, shape or form cheated or had an, an advantage over my opponent, it wouldn't be the same. It wouldn't be the same high. Do, do you think Ben Cousins has um, cheated? No, I don't. I think that he, I, yeah, I think he, he cheated. Ben Cousins cheated himself. Yeah, I don't think, he, I, think he, I don't think Ben Cousins cheated at all. Can, just, can you elaborate on your thought? Yeah, I, I think he cheated himself because I think he's such a great athlete and such a great person and I don't know him personally, well, I just know people who know him. Yeah, I just think that, um, yeah, he cheated, he cheated on himself because the Ben Cousins that I look at and see on the field was great and would have, be, would have been greater if he had not had three hours sleep a night or, you know, ten hours in a week or wanted to be what his friends wanted him to be instead of just wanted to be what he uh, had the natural ability and skill to be. I think that Ben, ben Cousins is one of those rare, great athletes who... Like I said, we we never seen the best of.